Boolean operations enable you to create simple solid models and combine them to create complex composite solid models. For our demonstration here, we are going to create a decorative interior lamp assembly. To route the wiring for our lamp assembly, we need to create an internal opening in the lamp pole. Since the size of this core opening is a standard, we have created a solid to the correct size and stored it in our library. This enables us to create it once and use it repeatedly in many different designs. Once the core is positioned, we simply subtract one solid from the other to create the opening. One of the most beneficial advantages to working with solid models is to be able to detect interferences between two or more components before they are manufactured, even if you cannot see the interference. At various stages during our assembly, we check for interferences. Our lampshade is a common component that is used in many different lamp designs. Therefore, it is manufactured with the smallest of mounting holes. This pole design uses a larger stud. To determine the opening needed, we simply assemble the components and check for interferences. The solid model created of the interference is then subtracted to obtain the correct opening. When you have features on two or more separate models that you need in your design, you can often create a single part of those features using the intersect command. Typically, this ornament design is located and unioned. However, the base is too large in this design. To obtain just the sculpted design, we use the intersect command. To complete the design, we pattern the sculpted shape on the base and then join or union it to the base. The process to union solids is just as simple as the subtraction. As you can see, we very quickly took some basic shapes and used Boolean operations to create a complex solid model to complete our design.